welcome to our tiny house. I'm going to go ahead and give you a tour. When you walk in the entryway, you are in the living room. Plenty of space for some chairs, perhaps a folding table, places to sit. Gets great light with lots of windows. And as you can see, all of the woodworking was done by a master carpenter, so it's beautifully finished. And as we enter further into the tiny house, we have the heater, which runs on propane. And a full kitchen, so there's a functional stove and oven, a full-sized refrigerator, lots of cabinet space, countertop space, really nice big sink. Here's an overview of the house looking out the door. Here's shelving, more cabinet space. And then we go into the bathroom. Here we have a sink, cabinets, and a composting toilet, which is actually not as difficult to operate as one might think. I had never used one before moving into this tiny house and quickly adjusted. It's also great for having a little impact on the environment. And here's the shower. There's also more storage space behind here. This is the hot water heater, room for shelving. And then we go back out into the main part of the house. And let's check out the lofts. So as you can see, the bathroom, the kitchen, and this is the fixed ladder going up to the loft, so it's fully affixed. And then we come up to the bedroom loft. So this is a queen size bed in here. Plenty of room on the sides of the bed. Again, really nice light. There's a beautiful skylight. And as we turn around, this gives you a view of the second loft. Great to make into a cozy sitting space or for storage, another bed. And then we look down on the house. So this is a great space for one or two people. We've lived in here with two people and two dogs at different times, so there's more room than you would think. And then as we go out, there's a great deck. It needs sweeping, but a great deck for sitting, hanging out, and the deck is also fully removable, so you can store it in the winter months if you want to, or leave it on. Again, here is a full view of the tiny house, constructed with cedar siding, again by a master carpenter builder. And here's a side view of the house. You'll see that hose there is the water hookup. Pretty simple to hook up to a water source and then plug right into the house. That's our, our tiny house. I hope you like it.